Give me a second. Oh, uh, hello everybody. We're playing, uh, Portal. Because why not? Uh, this is not a solo episode. I promise Structor is here somewhere. Maybe. Yes, I'm here. I, I don't know. I needed a second. Ah. Uh, Anyways. Uh, so, more Portal. Yep. I'm on that really hard puzzle where you have to go across a bridge and you have to kill all the turrets first. Uh. You know that one. Oh yeah, dude. Wait, no. I gotta actually check the stream. Yeah. Let me get it. Yeah. We normally use Steam for this sort of thing because it's pretty easy. Um, I don't know if there's any other better way to do it. I don't know if... Uh, because Steam has a bit of lag on it, as I've said before, but I'm not certain if uh, um, some other streaming sites like Twitch would be any better. But yeah. I don't think it would. But yeah, let's see. I kill off that portal. That turret, because screw that turret, I'm... I don't like turrets, they're evil evil beings oh yeah soon I think we'll have nuclear throne up and a nuclear throne cheating run without oh. cheats that'd be cool and it will last about an hour if not a bit more and we might splice it up we might not you know depends yeah platypus lasted about an hour but uh yeah this would this one would last for multiple multiple days. Ooh. Fun. <laughs> so I mean Maybe it is a good idea to split it up, I suppose. Into like three hours. Why yeah. are you killing the thing? Please kill the thing. Well, I don't think my internet connection didn't take connecting to Steam. Nah, I think it would oh, well. die. Anyways... Are you kidding me? So close. Well then, other things with the channel, um... Well... Hopefully I can get that dang computer corner video up soon. Yeah. I... Um, <laughs> our good and faithful editor who hasn't edited a single thing... <laughs> um... He is currently unable to record, so you'll never see him again. Hopefully he uh, gets Skype in Paris. I don't know how the connection speeds are in Paris. Wait, They're probably like, a lot better than they are in uh, Colorado. Well, like, Colorado's a bit closer. Well, yeah, but our internet speeds are terrible. The best internet we have is in, through an optical dish. And... Uh, we were actually worried because the it turned out a tree was going to block the internet in a few years. Like it was going to grow up between us and the disc and block our internet. Well, <laughs> so that was pretty funny. Like how how could a tree um, just mess up this high tech um, internet optical dish the garbage? The tree could have been very bushed. Oh. Bad joke. Poor taste. Well. But yeah, oh, the. But yeah, um, it's better than what we had before. I think it was like DSL or so. I don't know really. But have, um, have I mentioned that I hate Portal and some of its puzzles? <laughs> some of its puzzles. Mainly all of them. I mean, uh, Portal's a bit challenging. Small bit. It gets much harder once you. Uh, after the big twist, of course. Yeah, I'd expect it to. Yeah. But right now, it's impossible to figure out how to jump all the way over to the cu uh, the cube. Huh. Because I'm not sure how to, because there's nothing for me to fall from. You know what puzzle I'm talking about, right? Hmm. Not exactly certain. 
just look at the end of the last video. Well, the end of the last video was right after uh, Companion Cube, right? To yeah. Actually, something like that. And it was at the... Oh, I, I still see. remember. Oh, it's a pain in the ass. Uh, I gotta play Portal again. That's a game you gotta play. I play at least once every three months or so. It's a real classic. You play, uh, like, Cave Story a bit more? Yeah, I play Cave Story all the time. I mean, um... How can you not? Yeah, it's a pretty cool, uh, pretty cool game. Uh, I'm uh, still still working on Jenka's Nightmare, of course. Um, there are a ton of hacks for that game, of course. Um, ROM hacks or, like, cheats? Uh, ROM hacks. Oh. So, yeah, like... Uh, like, there's King's Story, there's Misery's Story. Um, Jenka's Nightmare is set up as a, a sequel to the original Cave Story. I want to know uh, more about uh, King. I don't really care about Jenka that much. I just want to know more about uh, King. Jenka's Nightmare. It sounds like a prequel or so, but it really is. A, um, but it really is a sequel, and you do still play as quote. In King's story, you you do play as King. And wait, see wait, as Adam. A, as a, Adam might actually watch, be watching this. <laughs> well, King is still the best character. Not as you... good as you know. Curly braces. What? Sorry. King's still my favorite. I mean, can you argue with curly braces? I mean, through the entire game. Curly is also really good. I like her, but uh, I don't like how uh, Adam tends to say how King sort of uh, King. You barely knew him, and he uh, uh, stupidly threw his life away. I don't. Well, I do not. Do. I disagree with that. I mean, um, first of all, King. You, you, you barely uh, know King. But you know I King, don't think he throws his life away. Yeah, he doesn't throw his life away. That's the first thing to be uh, aware this... of. Well, of course, um, cave story spoilers, obviously. But um, I mean, who hasn't played yeah, the game already? But he, what happens is, um, um, he uses his blade and kill and uh, defeats Balrog in one shot. One yes, shot. He's so if. He was able to do that. You think if he would have gotten the misery, he would have killed her in one shot because, um, or at least two. I don't know. I mean, if um, he wasn't overconfident or anything, that, uh, that I don't like that argument. And besides, you do know him fairly enough by that point. Like you have a sort of respect for him by that point. Like you, you he, understand uh, what he's trying yeah, to do. Yeah, stand about it, his position and such and what. Um, know about his responsibilities and such. I feel like you know him pretty well. But and one thing that you don't him. know about him is really what is his motivation or not really, but what is his motivation for saving you? For that that's you just don't really you? know. It it was just like uh to to kill misery. Oh but wait, I mean, kill well, misery well because uh she just poisoned uh, Torco. But still, what's his motivation for saving you? Oh, he do uh, he doesn't really save you. Well, he kind of. Or, uh, no, sorry. Well, he saves you in a way. He yeah, but he doesn't sword. know he does it. And yeah, he wants you to avenge him. That's... Yeah. Which, I... Ironically, the King's Sword is actually good with taking down Misery, at least I... at level That's not two. really ironic. That's more well, yeah, of a... That's more of a really yeah, expectedly, cool thing. Yeah, expectedly, I suppose. And, like, if you look at some of the credits images, it shows uh, you taking down a... Uh, uh, taking down King with the... I mean, sorry, taking down Misery with the King Sword. Yeah. Which isn't really ironic, it's more of a... It's, it's more intended. But, yeah. Oh, there's a second part to this puzzle? Oh, gosh. Well, yeah, so, anyways, um... Uh, let's see. The one thing which is which one character which is completely underappreciated, and I think you would agree on with me on this, is really Torco. Uh, all she's she, alright. All she has going for her is that she's cute. <laughs> That's about it. Uh, she's alright. I really like uh, the boss fights. That like, one's a pain in the ass. Her, like, oh, um. How, um, yeah, you sort of have to, uh, 
the floor. Well, we already boxes. spoiled the game anyway, so... Yeah, I'll put it in the description. Cave Story spoilers. Don't watch if you haven't played the game, because the game is amazing. Who reads the yeah, description? Torko. Torko. Uh, oh, yeah. Like, in the uh, last portal video, I put... Uh, we're so Sucre for this video. Sucre. <laughs> I'm so Sucre. How do I apologize again? Sucre. What's yeah, I'm that Sucre. word again? Sorry. Who needs? I, I'm Sucre. Yeah. So uh, this that video was a mess. <laughs> it was. Oh. It's. We should just delete it off you the face. Adam are just going at it. We should just delete it off the face of the internet. <laughs> oh, it's a... It's getting good views, as in five of them. Yeah, that's the most we've ever hit, right? Well, the most we ever hit is, I think, 125. No, it isn't. On the uh, Platypus Cheating Run Part 1. That's because uh, I uh, because you're wanted to demonstrate that course. glitch in the game. and what uh, glitch? The glitch where you destroy the purple jet... Uh, thousands of times and rack up a huge score. Um, so I actually uh, told people about it on the uh, Shmups forum. Which, by the way, I wish there was a better name for the two, for 2D shooters. I'll, I'll just call them 2D shooters. Yeah, we should have a bit more. Shmups sounds really awful. Shmups. I know who thought of that. It's supposed to be like a uh, ma mash together the words shoot him up, which Again, this is it's a bit silly. It's sort of uh, irritating as well, because again, it doesn't really describe them as well as 2D shooter does. But oh well. Well, I uh, think I, 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 I think I'm screwed because I have no idea what to do. Oh, too bad. Um. So this is gonna be the gameplay. Um. Yeah, I'll send you a card in the mail about that level. Instead of thank you or get well, I'll say get better. No, it's the puzzle the where everything's on stilts. And there's oh, yeah. acid below you, and I have no idea what to do. The game can be a bit disorienting sometimes, because if you jump through a portal, uh, like, uh, feet first, then you come out, Head and then first. you have to come out feet first. But then you flip over, like, I so wish you could come out, like, um, you could have, like, a neutral, uh, I don't know, um... Ending? Ha! Huh. Like, I'm not exactly certain how to say it, but if you only could be, like, a floating eye in the game that hovers instead of, uh, instead of being a body with feet and such, therefore you would never have to flip over, so maybe that wouldn't work either. I have no, 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 I have no idea. Yeah. I, um, imagine virtual reality portal. That would yeah. actually be... That could be really good, though. That could be, like, really, really good. I would yeah. I would play it. Anything for them to make another portal game. As much as I complained about Portal 2, it's still an awesome game. And uh, I'd like to see them make another one, except Valve doesn't seem too interested in their single-player games right now. Yeah, which is kind of It's sad. only a matter of time, I suppose, unless... Valve really decide, uh, really go decides that their game development is yeah. unprofitable, which I I can I can't see them doing that really. I mean, they make a lot of money off of Steam though. Yeah, like look at all the uh, think about how much money like Half Life Two and uh, um, Portal have made over the years and such. Yeah. Oh, yeah, the Steam Summer Sale is coming up. Yeah, could, I need so, help with this puzzle because I'm super confused. Oh, sorry, I can't really help you very well, you're considering my situation Oh, yeah, here. your situation. My com this computer, I got it from this guy in Colorado, and uh, I guess he got it from a uh, realtor, I suppose, and it has, like, um, Panas some Panasonic thing in it, Picasa, I remember Picasa, um, why pops? I have no idea what that is. And a bunch of other junk. Oh gosh. Let's see, like... Could have been used... Assistance. I didn't think remote assistance was on XP home version. Oh well. So, yeah, I'm kind of stuck here. Because, oh, I think I know what to do, but it's... 
It's that crappy puzzle where you have to use the momentum of falling down and going up. Oh yeah. And it disor and it's so disorienting. <sighs> because it yeah, it's it's that really it's not any words bad, it's just hard. Yeah. Um None of the portal puzzles puzzle. are bad. Um, They're just really, really hard. Um, yeah, so... Champagne, coffee, gasoline... So, yeah. What should we talk about? Well, um... How my portals... brother is, uh, trying to build a computer, so I guess I could have more, uh, Don't do that, dummies. <laughs> Everybody's favorite. Of <laughs> my, uh, <laughs> I don't know. So are you calling me yeah, a like, dummy? No, I'm calling people who install a, uh, micro ATX board into a mini ITX case, dummies. Because that? that don't work, dummy. Who does that? Micro ATX is actually bigger than mini ITX, which is really confusing because mini sounds like it would be, uh, bigger than micro. I know. And who does so, that? Well, obviously you can't do that, sadly, but whatever. You're still a dummy if you try to fit it in. Who tries? Uh, nobody, I suppose, so there aren't any dummies. But there's plenty more dummies in other places, like, um, let's say... Video games? I mean, uh... What else is there? Um, I already talked about RAM. Oh, What's I got that? a great one. If the, if the screws on the mother... Oh, the screw sockets on the motherboard don't line up with the standoffs in your case. Don't try to put the motherboard in. You'll mess it up, dummy. That's so, like shorting out the motherboard with drops of water or so. so Break your motherboard, dummy. So I might have to uh, skip this uh, level. Just skip it because it's not working. All right. It it won't allow me to. You'll you'll see it in the video, but it won't allow me to change how much where my fi my field of view is. Oh, well, that's all right. When I jump into it, so it's gonna be about a bit of a, a little bit of me just jumping into portals and figuring out. All right. Stuff. Oh, what other ones are there? Um, um you know, don't, don't don't buy a motherboard that's too big for your case. Yeah, obviously, don't... I mean, don't I think that's that. common sense. And if you try punishing, and you don't have the proper standoff, you break it. But make sure the standoffs line up, or be absolutely certain that you got it right. Um, what else is there? There are so many things you can get wrong, like it's just... Not even <laughs> I think for the description of this video, it's I another think... boring video with people talking about computers. I think I saw somebody online, I think it was Linus, he he tried to um, repair an AMD processor which has the pins on the processor chip by uh, um, because one of them broke off or got bent or so and then got broke off because he tried to pin it back Jeez. and um, then he he shoved it into the board. What? I mean, I want to. I really want to say, don't do that, dummy. But it ended up working, actually. <laughs> but I mean, it's self-explanatory. Don't do but, that, dummy. Yeah, I mean, still, if unless you're very, unless you're Linus from Linus Tactics, don't do that, dummy. You break it. <laughs> exactly. Uh, and yeah, of course, if you have the pins on the bottom of the CPU, well, if you oh. don't touch him, dummy, you break something. <laughs> And that has been our few minutes of Don't Do That Dummy with Strucka. Don't do that, dummies. <laughs> with, Don't be a dummy and listen to with, us. With Structa125. You know, Join us actually, next episode for Don't Do That Dummies with your host, The Gungeon. But he'll know, be talking about idiots and what they should not do. Is our catchphrase for is my catchphrase gonna be don't be an atom or don't be a dummy? Mine is don't be an atom. All right, you can have that. I'll be, mine will be don't be a dummy. Don't be a dummy. Don't do that, dummy. Don't do it. <laughs> hey, dummy, did you take my lunch money? Don't do that, dummy. <laughs>
Jeez, we're, we're horrible people. <laughs> uh, remember, just don't be an atom. Yes. And since he's probably not going to be watching these videos while he's in Yeah, Paris, hopefully he doesn't watch this one. He's a dummy. <laughs> do you want to insult him? Oh, I won't insult him. He's in Paris. He can't do anything. <laughs> I know. That's the perfect time to insult him. Fair. Oh, come on. He takes free shots at me all the time. Then you can insult him yourself. He's a dummy. He, he he repaired one of his computers with duct tape, and it still didn't work. Oh yeah, I, I actually, uh... It, w it was a bit of a sorry sight if we are going to get in there. I'm sorry, Adam, but I have to mention it. Um, Don't repair I, uh, the computer with duct tape, dummy. Well, um... One of the cables was getting frayed that was on it, on one of the uh, pieces of exposed metal on it. Um, I was sort of worried that that was attached to like an antenna or something, or even the monitor. Um, but the uh, internal uh, Wi-Fi doesn't work in it anymore. I don't know really. Well, it worked selectively, I seem to remember. As in, it loaded, uh, it didn't load Google Chrome, the install Google Chrome page. I guess when Microsoft Edge was trying to prevent me from installing Chrome. Okay. That's what I meant. You know, should we just end this episode here? Because yeah, I can't get past this level. Alrighty then. It's that really bad level. Okay. You know, you know the one where you have to use momentum to jump up, but you can't... But, uh, there are these certain platforms. And I think I know the one you're talking about. Yeah, and you have to use it to jump up, but instead of when you try to... Give me a it, second. Okay. Hey guys, welcome to Screen Tearing 101. How do you like how that screen tears? Me? That's how I get off. What do you think? That screen tearing okay? You try doing that at home. I got it, I got it. I think I got it. Yes. Okay, never mind, we're not gonna end the episode. So it's... We will if I don't make it. Okay guys, we're gonna end the episode here, so we can just skip it. Alright. So I made it to the second one, but we're just gonna end the episode here. Alright, that sounds good. And I'm gonna get, and through the magic of me spending hours and hours of time just doing nothing except playing this game, I will magically be on the next episode. Alright, give me a second though, I need, I need to talk with my brother for a second. So, uh, yeah. So how you guys doing? How's the wife? Or kids? Or girlfriend? Oh yeah, pretty good. Pretty good. Why well, thank you for asking, you know. Someone's never been this nice to me before, especially with Adam being around. Jeez, he's a prick. Oh, you like him. Oh, and you know, I'm sorry, there's not much there to like. Yep. But don't worry, there are much better people in the world. I call them, uh, computers. So, yeah, how, how, how? So, yeah? How many people have you killed recently? Only that many? Man, you're really slacking. Okay, that's okay, you know. Killing killing people sometimes wrong. That's understandable. But yeah. <laughs> Monotonous gameplay? Yep. So I think that will do us for this episode. Have a wonderful day. Bye. Bye.